We've always looked at the Nürburgring as the ultimate validation for the car. We have on-site tracks and we rent tracks in North America, uh, but there's nothing quite like the Nürburgring. Bringing the ZR1 to the Nürburgring because we feel we have a pretty substantial performance upgrade. The Michelin Pilot Sport Cup tires uh, are much stickier. Uh, we also have other chassis uh, improvements. We have aero improvements. Uh, so we hope to show that we've really improved the capability of the car. The Sport Cup uh, represents the total optimization around dry performance. That's why it's the most appropriate for the track. It's the most highest performance uh, tire you can buy that's street legal. It telegraphs its limits uh, very clearly to the driver, and it has an unusual combination of lateral traction and longitudinal traction. That lets the driver get back on the gas right after the apex of a corner. On Corvette, the tire engineer for Michelin is the same engineer that uh, engineers tires for the race car. We are always looking for technology transfer. Um, we go to the track on Sunday and then we're engineering tires for the production car uh, during the week. This Pilot Sport Cup represents the latest and most intense collaboration between the Michelin engineering team and the production cars team. The car is set up completely stock uh, as it would be received by a real customer. Uh, we do have to add some uh, safety equipment which actually adds weight uh, to the vehicle and actually slows us down a little bit. But the, the rest of the car is to production specifications including alignment and trim height and everything that would normally uh, expect out of a factory vehicle uh, up to and including the suspension parameters including the Michelin uh, Pilot Sport Cup tires. This time at the Nürburgring, we're lucky enough to have Jim Merrill back as our test driver. He's our chassis development engineer at Team Corvette. Uh, he's been on the job uh, for quite a long time. He drove the ZR1 you know, three years ago when we were there. The great thing about Jim is he's a super uh, competent driver, uh, super consistent, and the feedback we get can be applied to the car as it's driven on the street. So we're always trying to balance the capability on the track with comfort on and capability on the street, Jim's the perfect guy to do both those things.